Thursday, May the whatever, 4th, 5th, out here on 101 South, leaving Crescent City, first of several, one lane only, while they're working, they're uh, digging out a landslide here on uh, the left, as uh, you can see, wow, what a mess. Okay, that was number one. I'm on uh, my way down to Eureka. Yeah, there's no road now on uh, the right on the other side of the barriers. It's completely gone. Another spot where the road is collapsing. the coast here on uh, the right and I can already see the cars coming in the other direction so hopefully this will not be a long wait we're coming into the one of the serious slide areas now that make up last chance grade This wooden wall on the left here that's barely visible was built after we moved in and it's already cracking. Here's another section coming up here on uh, the left. The retaining walls are already buckling <coughs> from uh, the downhill pressure as uh, the whole mountain starts to slide into the ocean. The slide here on the right is uh, is uh, the past year major collapse. And we have one more coming up here that uh, just developed uh, a few months ago. Okay, here we are at the last alternate uh, one-way short stretch. We're almost down to Wilson Creek to uh, bypass 101 here is, uh, and to make it uh, safe for travel for a long, long time, we have to go pretty far inland. We're gonna have to cut through some uh, pieces of uh, Redwood Park, which is problematic. Also some uh, Indian tribal lands that uh, have uh, special meaning to uh, the tribes that have to be skirted, along with uh, several salmon and uh, steelhead creeks that will have to be bridged. So this is a federal project, because this is uh, US 101 and uh, it's going to be a, uh, who knows, 500 million to a billion dollars. There we go. We're out for now. Yeehaw.